Hey everybody, before this uh, video starts, I just wanted to let you guys know that I have a, I have uh, started an Instagram page, in case you hadn't seen that last video I did there uh, a few weeks ago. So uh, link in the description, check that out, uh, share it with everybody, I'm really trying to spread the channel here and uh, kind of get the word out. So yeah, without further ado, let's get into the video. Alright everybody, today is uh, March 9th, 2020, and uh, welcome back to South Dakota for the first official video of 2020. Now uh, today, we're out here on the farm loading up the truck. Uh, we're going to haul all our corn out and get it to the elevator and maybe soybeans if we get there. Uh, right now we're taking out of our biggest bin, which holds uh, 12,000 bushels. The, the other three hold 7,000. This bin behind me right here is empty and we're working on our second bin and we're getting close to getting the door open and once we get there we'll throw the sweep in and uh, get it cleaned out and after that we'll move on to the next bin. I think grandpa's been hauling for a couple days now and now I'm on spring break so I can be up here to uh, help them sweep and you know trade off driving the truck and whatnot um, and so far as we haven't had any issues with corn running or anything like that. It hasn't been sticking. It's It's been coming out of the bin at a cold temperature. So everything's been going all right so far. We haven't had any issues there. So uh, yeah, uh, I'll be recording over the next week or so so you guys can see what we're up to. And uh, without further ado, let's get going. We're hitting the road. Now we're heading to town to, uh, I think this is the fourth load of the day. We're going to drop that off, come back. The uh, grain bin is getting down to the point where we're going to have to sweep it soon. So uh, we should hit that when we get back and uh, we'll go from there. Well, we're at the elevator now. Uh, we're going to head over to pit two here, which is the one to the right. <clears throat> and uh, it sounds like I'll be unloading myself this time. You know, when I did track, I was a high jumper yeah. for two years or one year. Yeah. Yep.
right, everybody, it is the morning of March 10th. Today is Tuesday, it's the uh, next day. If that wasn't obvious, uh, right now what we're doing is we're bringing my truck in to get the brakes, calipers, rotors, I think the parking brake fixed. As you can see, it's a little bit foggy today. Uh, my truck's needed this for a while, or just the last couple days it started making a lot of uh, crackling noises and gravelly kind of noises so I thought it'd be best to take it in now um, so yeah that's what we're doing now once we get back uh, the truck has a full load uh, we threw the sweet bogger in the bin yesterday after we got rained out and we filled it up so we can take it in this morning and uh, we'll, we'll dump that and then we'll finish sweeping the bin and then uh, we will go from there and just like that we're through the fog cloud so uh, I'll just keep driving here and uh, we'll go back to you when we go to dump that truck. See you then. Okay, bud? You okay? Well, as you can see, it's a little bit foggy today. I'm not sure when it's supposed to lift, but uh, it's supposed to be, well, close to 60 today and sunny, so we'll see what happens.
last load of corn, then we're moving on to soybeans. Uh, it is uh, about 10 o'clock on March 12th, Thursday. And I don't know if you can, if the camera will pick it up, but the uh, train is coming through right now. They're picking up some oil tankers. You can sit, see it sitting over there. It's got three engines on it today. <clears throat> now we're headed into town here to uh, dump this last little corn here. And uh, Grandpa's back at the farm getting the soybean bins set up and ready to go. So he'll have that ready by the time I get back. And we'll just move on to soybeans and hopefully we will finish them tomorrow. Because we got rain coming Friday nights and Saturday. So we'll see what happens. Here it is guys, the last load of soybeans and all grain on the farm. We're gonna take this in uh, once we get the auger all taken down and whatnot, and then uh, we'll be done. Feels good. Well, that wasn't so bad. Well guys, it's going to do it for uh, this video here. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed watching us uh, haul corn and soybeans throughout the last, what, five days of this week. Now with the coronavirus getting out, I have an extra week of school off, so that's a plus. I don't know what I'm going to do with it, but it sounds like it's supposed to snow, so uh, maybe have some fun in the snow. Who knows? We'll see. Anyways, uh, thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed and we will see you in the next video which will probably be tillage or planting. One of those two. So until then, thanks for watching.